Hi, I'm Elisa Paselli from MyMac.com, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Rukus or the Ruckus Solar Bluetooth Sound System by Eton. And it looks like this. Um, this piece right up here is the solar panel, so when you're outside, it gets the uh, charges the battery from the sun, obviously, with the word solar in it. Um, this is the e-ink screen, so you can see it in bright sunlight, just like you would with a Kindle. This icon is showing that the battery is fully charged. This icon is showing that the USB is on so that you can also charge your iPhone while you're listening to the music. This is the Bluetooth button, so it lets you know that it is connected to the Bluetooth. If we were outside right now, there would be an icon right here showing that it is getting the energy from the sun, so there'd be a little solar icon over here. This is the auxiliary button if you choose not to connect your device uh, through, the, through the Bluetooth you can attach a, um, a cord and connect your device to the speakers through the auxiliary. This is the base on and off button and then obviously these are the up and down buttons for the volume. This device, the Rokus Solar Bluetooth Sound System, is compatible with smartphones, tablets, laptops, and computers that have Bluetooth, which is pretty much most devices nowadays. Now, one of the things that I really like about the, about the Rokus Solar Bluetooth Sound System is that while you're listening to your, your device, as in right now it's the iPhone, uh, you can charge it at the same time. Now this is on the back before I show you that. This is an elastic band that keeps the iPhone in place securely and then here is a ledge that it will sit on and then here would be the USB. So first let's listen to the sound. Okay, I'm going to turn that off right now. Now as you could tell if you're an audiophile, the sound quality is not stellar that you would get with a more expensive unit, but if you just want to see if you're out at the beach, you're out at the pool, you're at a party, and you just want to listen to some music, I think it's perfectly fine. It's, it sounds good for me. So what I'm going to do now is place the iPhone in the band. You can see that it's secure on the shelf right here, and you can just plug it in. Oops. And now it's charging by USB. And just make sure that the USB right here, the USB button is pushed down so that it knows to charge by USB. Now one of the things that I really like about this is that with this band, it, the iPhone is protected from the sun so it's not getting hit by the sun and, and taking a chance of being overheated. And that these band, I'm sorry, these um, cords are not bending. I've had that problem with other units that I've used and they're not bending so there's no there's no danger of um, of breaking on the on the power charger which which is what I like. And it just sits here like this. Um, it takes approximately three hours to charge an empty battery if you plug it in or about six hours if you let it charge by the sun. Um, I don't know how long it will last once you start using it but in my experiments sitting outside for about four hours in the sun um, using this on a nice, not even a really sunny day, sometimes it was just a cloudy day and the battery would only drop a little bit. There's four different little, you can't see it right now, but there's four different little bars on the battery and it only dropped one battery. So my guess is that you can get a good eight hours out of a, out of a charge. Now the only problem that I did have with this sound system is I had difficulty getting the Bluetooth connection on my MacBook and I'm not sure why that is. I don't know if it was an issue with the Bluetooth, with the computer itself. It took me a number of tries before it finally connected but once it did it stay, stayed connected and I was able to use it no problem. It was great for listening to or watching Netflix movies because sometimes they do come out a little bit low and with the Mac speakers are sometimes a little low so using this uh, watching Netflix was really good. The only other issue I have with this is that the retail price is $150. You can find it a little bit less on online retailers. 
I found $150 to be a little steep. Um, you can find other units like this, other speakers, for under $100. I think you're paying the, the extra money because it does have that solar capability. For me personally, I think that's that's a lot of money, but for someone else, it might be just what they're looking for, for camping trips or trips out to the beach or where they're going somewhere and they don't want to have to worry about having an electrical outlet close by. So again, this is the Rukus Solar Bluetooth Sound System by Eaton, and I would give it a 8 out of 10 on the MyMac.com review rating scale. So this is Elisa Paselli from MyMac.com. I'll speak to you soon.